Jones. That's right, my friend. Let me ask you, does a machine like yourself ever experience fear? Yo, what's going on guys? So before we get into the video, I want to invite each and every one of you to join my Discord server. The link to that will be in the description below. Alright, so the skill that we're talking about today is Side Bridge, and you get it from the Parallel Quest number 39, 17 to 18 of the official history. Now, it's a pretty cool skill as skills go. It goes out and it comes back. Now, the win conditions of this Parallel Quest is you have to keep all the support characters that come to help you, you got to keep them alive. Try to keep them above 50%, and then it won't uh, hurt if you transform, if you have a transformation, and then, you know, end with the ultimate attack, whatever like that. I did it and got the skill first try. I don't know why I didn't have this skill before now, but like I said in the previous video there are a bunch of skills out there that are just floating around that i didn't get from parallel quest for whatever reason so uh yeah the parallel quest really really simple i went in there with team gt i'm using trunks and then i've got little kid goku with me and then super saiyan 4 vegeta all right so i'm just going to show you the parallel quest now for whatever reason i wanted to take this into pvp and see how effective it would be in pvp but it is 7 15 2018 and for whatever reason, the PvP is not working this morning with Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. I keep getting communication errors and the game freezes. I hope they fix that sometime soon. Probably if you're watching this video a little bit later, it might already be fixed. So yeah. Alright, so if you want to get the ultimate finish for this uh, parallel quest, I mean, I don't. it might be necessary for you to get the ultimate finish because I, I didn't see side bridge drop until like I got the ultimate finish part. So uh, when Android 17 becomes like Super Villain 17 or whatever like that. So I'm just going to show you the parallel quest uh, and everything that I've done. Alright, so right here fighting Android 17. This is really a pushover, man. You can see I'm using GT Trunks, bro. It's it's not even that hard, especially at this stage of the game. Um, I am max level 99 on this character. Alright, so pretty much we finished Android 17 and then we're going to watch him hop right back up. And then he's going to fly off and we have to go off and chase him. And then what's going to happen is you're going to fight 17 and 18 at the same time. And then once you defeat both of them, that's going to cause the ultimate finish. And then they're going to turn super villain. And then at some point in time, Android 16 is going to join the battle. And then you have to defeat all of them at the same time. And then once you do that, that's pretty much the ultimate finish. All right. So they're destroy Android 17. Super simple. I'm trying to figure out like, because I haven't used GT Trunks in a minute. So I was like, damn, what moves does he have? Because I want to be able to use an ultimate attack to get the ultimate finish. All right. There's my transfer transformation i was saving that for the end a little bit and uh that just helps your chances out whenever you're trying to get a better rating for the parallel quest it is still to me very unsure and there's the finish it's still to me very unsure whether or not you get a better rng chance if you get a higher rating on the parallel quest all right, I, I know what some of you might say, yeah, if you get a Z rank, obviously you're going to get a better chance to get whatever you're trying to get, but it's still very RNG, like it's really not guaranteed, or it might be, because I Z ranked this this time, and I got the uh, skill that I was looking for, which, so I don't know, I've done that before, Z ranked the mission, and still not gotten the skill, so it's, it's kind of still like up in the air RNG for me, I hope they do do something with that, and you know, maybe regularize it, regularize, is that a word? Um... Just make some sort of thing for Xenoverse 3 when that does come out. Okay, so now they are in super villain version. Just basically got to defeat them. And then there's Android 16 coming around doing that bloody sauce or bloody whatever it is. That's really friggin' annoying. All right, trying to get a perfect clock there. That, that really didn't work at all like I planned it for. Okay, Android 17 behind him and going to hit him with a nice stamina break. Down he goes. And now I'm going to try to hit him with my ultimate attack. But I got interrupted from doing that. That is great. There's my ultimate attack right there. And it did not work. GT Goku throwing in that Kamehameha. Trying to come in a little bit clutch. Oh, wow. That stamina break did not work. It got grabbed. Is it just me? Or since this last update, or maybe the update before last, the AI, when they help you, they, they do more getting in the way than they do helping, right? It's like you're trying to do your whatever on the character you're fighting. And then, oh, there it goes. Stamina break on him. And then this is definitely going to be the ultimate attack right here. Uh, Yep. So there is the ultimate attack that I got off finally, and I'm just going to finish that up off on Android 18. Now she has got half health, uh, a full bar and a half, <laughs> half health, and I've got to go ahead and finish her off really quickly to get the uh, Z rank. Now look at the time I've got going on here. It's 11 minutes so far. I'm not sure exactly how much time we had in the beginning, but I do know there's a time thing in there. Like if you do the uh, parallel quest super fast, although some of these parallel quests, you really can't, 
do them super fast because they do take a long time to use and she tried to use an ultimate attack there i don't know what happened i got kind of scared i was like oh no she's gonna hit me with this ultimate attack and i got no stamina all right got her hemmed up over the corner her health is going down super low thank you gt goku for doing whatever it is you got to do to help me out gosh look at his health though gt goku's health is going down hella fast on this parallel quest and that stamina break did not work on android 17 but she's pretty much almost done gonna charge up and try to hit with that kamehameha and she ran right back into it the ai is so smart and then here comes the finish on android 16 oh got a stamina break down on him and i've got no key so i'm gonna power up and i wanted to do an ultimate attack on it but that just did not work out i'm gonna hit him with a, a full power energy volley uh, your opinion, man. Full power energy volley. Does it need to stay or does it need to go? I know some people are saying, well, you got to knock him away and then do it. Even still, though, I don't like the skill. I like full power energy wave better than all of, well, better than that one, I should say. There's some skills that full power energy wave is just better than, I think. And I hit him with that ultimate attack and there goes a final flash from Super Saiyan for Vegeta and no sir you're not going to hit me with that oh maybe you are I had the blocks I wasn't sure if I was going to get hit and then there goes the shining slash and I tried to stamina break him but he had the stamina shout out to Mike Dombrowski for helping me with that and that was going to be the end of him and then that sidestep him and there it goes there's your ultimate finish and then once you get the ultimate finish there is a good chance like a 70% chance that you are going to get what you are looking for and there it is super attack side bridge now let's go and check out side bridge and see how good it is or how much it sucks you know i've never used it before this so let's check it out all right so i've got my key blast character yoshi and i'm going to try it on android 17 just regular and see the damage now what's really good about this skill is that it is pretty much instant cast like you can do it right from attack and it just goes off you can punch 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 and then shoot it but the damage eh, so so the thing about this is is that it comes back to attack your opponent so maybe if you're fighting an opponent that is fighting you back and you throw it and they hit you they're gonna get interrupted now you notice that second blast of it the second wave when it comes back it doesn't do any damage what that's meant to do in in my opinion in my my eyes it's meant to just stop your opponent from attacking you it's meant to stop them from attacking you so you can get back on top because the skill is very instant cast so you're attacking 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 maybe you snap vanish and then i don't know just a bunch of different combinations that you can do with side bridge that makes it very very useful however it is boo boo to poo poo on damage that's not a roast it's just the truth it doesn't do that much damage and i was just going around testing and see what transformation and uh, what combination of transformation and super soul rather makes it do more damage here we got Kyle Ken, and I've been saving this one, Kyle Ken, because obviously you're not going to use Kyle Ken without that Super Soul. That'd be dope if they gave us another Super Soul with Kyle Ken that made us go stronger. Like, hopefully, they're going to give us a new transformation, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Kyle Ken, that has a better Super Soul with it or whatever, like that. Let us maintain the form. That would actually be really, really dope if they put that in the game. All right, so uh, yeah, and this is potential unleashed right now, and. Yeah, just I'm not seeing a whole lot. 2,518 with that. And I'm going to go ahead and transform into potential least again and see 2,846 points of damage on that one. All right, thank you guys so very much for checking out this video. Do me a favor and click on one of these because you might enjoy them as well. And if you haven't already, please join my Discord server. I'll see you there. Peace out.